Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for notification. We received two requests. The first was to not edit out all of Chantel talking, and the second was to not change her voice. We would like to be able to do both but we can't. Her audio is horrible to say the least. The road noise in her car, while she is driving is so loud it sounds like a raging river. We were able to reduce the road noise quite a bit. However that left her voice audio not that much better. We also tried to keep the editing down to a minimum. We apologize to those viewers that had made the request, this is the best that we could do. Hey guys, hey, how are you, how are you? Welcome back to another video. Today I have a special treat for you guys. Is it a special treat for us, or is it really a special treat for you? And for myself. <laughs> we are going to a 40 foot orange. Yes, we are indeed. So we are going to be taking a little road trip to Jibo's Gibo, Orange Julep in um, Montreal, Quebec. So this is a iconic roadside attraction. It is a restaurant that is shaped like a giant 40 foot orange and their main attraction now what they're known for is their orange julep and orange julep is a drink that is made with they make theirs with fresh sun-kissed oranges it is an orange drink that is almost like an orange julius it's got that like um orange creamy orange kind of flavor so it is served cold and i am so excited to have one it's been a while since i've been there and they have other really good food like hot dogs, hamburgers. They have really awesome puts in. There's so many places in uh, Montreal and in Quebec area that have really wonderful puts in. And it is pronounced puts in. That is the French way to say it. Um, Anglophone people will call it poutine, but it is actually puts in. And I'm sure a lot of you Frenchies out there will be able to back me up on that one. Putin or Putin, who cares? You can't even pronounce Porsta correctly. So, alright, I will um, show you guys some of the road here, and whenever we get there, I will show you this magnificent establishment, and we'll have something to eat, and we'll enjoy our time together. So, alright, see you guys soon. Alright, so it was a lot more packed than I thought it would be because it is a major roadside attraction um, tourist trap, um, like I said, so pretty iconic for Montreal, so um, it wasn't long of a wait though, my food took like one minute, um, so, but uh, this is what the drink looks like, I just got a medium, so here it says on here, made with sun-kissed oranges daily, okay, so, so if you're wondering, it's on Des Carrie Boulevard or Des Carrie Boulevard <laughs> in Montreal. So let's try here. Mmm. Oh yeah. Tastes like a creamsicle. Mmm. Okay. So I got a hot dog and a puts in. So let's see here. You want to see what a real true puts in looks like? I got a medium and one hot dog. Look at this. Oh, these cheese curds. 
and the rich gravy. Oh, and the fries are homemade, home cut fries. Okay, let's give you a beauty bite. <laughs> beauty bites. Grub time. in the next video. Bye guys.